What is up YouTube? Thank you for checking in. Uh, it's just me by myself here today. Um, I'm going to do a reaction video to Ghost. So I recently just got into him. Uh, I, like, I've only heard two songs so far. Um, like, very recently. So uh, this is my third time listening to him. So far I like him a lot and I'm going to get into a little bit more detail later. Uh, but I did a little bit of research on them. They kind of popped in my head. I knew about them for a really long time. I just never actually heard them until like super recently. And like I said, I'm only on my third song now, which is why I'm like, I really just wanted to do a reaction video while it's still organic because I was, I'm, I've been really impressed so far. Um, a little bit of research shows me that, yeah, they do have a ton of fans, but they also have a lot of people, especially more like in the metal community that don't like them because uh, they're not as metal, I guess, as their like imagery would portray, uh, which is why I like them, which is why like 20 years ago when I first heard the Misfits, I thought they were going to be a death metal band based off of like that Crimson Ghost. And, you know, I was a lot younger, so I saw Skulls and they must be metal. And then I hear the smooth vocals and I'm like, wow, I actually like this. So I think like so far, and I can't speak for every Ghost song because I've only gotten into two so far. Um, it seems like, you know, like heavier Music, not super heavy, not, you know, but uh, a little bit heavy with so far very surprisingly like softer vocals that might not necessarily match that genre or that like musicianship that they're bringing in, but I like it a lot. That's why I like it. So it works for me. I guess it doesn't work for everybody, but hey, I mean, they clearly have a lot of fans. So two songs in, I'm one of them so far, you know, that might be a fluke. I don't know. Here we are. We're going to find out. Um, I did brief research just to find the uh, pronunciation of this song, and I believe it's Cerise. If I'm wrong. Oh, well, whatever. Might not like this song. I might like it. We'll see. Uh, but without further ado, I'm going to react to Ghost uh, Cerise. We're going to see how it is. Kind of reminds me of Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah, you know what? Let me pause it right here. And it already looks like they're kind of going for that old vintage, uh, like an 80s uh, horror movie theme. Just by like the opening, because it's clearly looking like an opening uh, credit, or I should say an opening um, title screen of a movie. Uh, kind of looks like, like a 16 millimeter film. Um, I'm really big into 80s horror. And here's Freddy as he is, a bunch of other stuff on me. Uh, so. I, I guess the video so far, uh, 24 seconds in, I do like because it does remind me of um, that just standard cookie cutter 80s horror style. But we'll go on. I might be completely off on them. Although knowing Ghost so far in their imagery, I'm probably not too far off. I did see the Square Hammer video, that was awesome. Yeah, I can see like the film grain on the uh, screen. It's probably all digital, making it look like it's old school 16 millimeter. I don't know, but I do like that look. All right, I'm liking the instrumentals a lot. Yeah, this is awesome. Okay. I feel your presence among the stars. You cannot hide in the darkness. Oh, actually, hold on. I was about to pause on something else, but let's see what I land on. Okay, uh, I'll get back to the secondary thing I was going to pause. Vocals, I'm telling you, I like, I, I think it's awesome that it's not like a growling, deep, like super deep demonic voice. Uh, so far now, this is the third time I'm hearing him. Kind of reminds me of Skeletor singing almost. So yeah, that's that's my take on it. I like it. I, it's not super metal, death metal, black metal that I thought they would be. And that's kind of why I like them. Uh, 
<laughs> I like this a lot. That riff, I'm actually going to go back. I, I, I'm I loving that uh, riff that came in. Yeah, it's right when this guy walks off stage. Mm -hmm. And if I were like a pro wrestler in the 90s, when like the entrance music was just instrumental, this would be like something I'd want. Right there, uh, let me go back to the shot of his guitar. Yeah, right there. Okay, um, I, I wasn't really expect this is just for you guitar nerds out there. Uh, I wasn't expecting a Cherry Burst Les Paul with this style. I was more expecting like a BC Rich Warlock or at least an SG or a Flying V or something. Uh, very interesting. But I don't know, maybe that's just me being uh, nitpicky. So he's playing on the neck, the neck humbucker. But anyway, yeah, that's exactly a stereotypical guitar in the metal world, I guess. Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know, but I think classic rock with that cherry burst, Les Paul. Um, but hey, they break all the rules so far. It's kind of cool. Tempany going. Yeah, let's let's voice get high. This is such a cool riff. I'm like that guy in the crowd who's enjoying it when no one else is. I'm not saying nobody else likes the song, I'm talking about the people in the crowd. Ooh, alright, got a breakdown already. Earlier than I would have expected. I can see through the scars inside you. I can feel the thunderous breaking in your heart. I can see through the scars inside you. Yes! <laughs> oh, that was the perfect time. It's not like the bands that I'm familiar with that like I listen to. I guess it almost reminds me like a mix, like a mix between like the Misfits, a little bit of like Bayside, and then thrown with like like Iron Maiden and Megadeth or something. Like they're dark, but they're not like too in your face heavy. Um, like even with their imagery, like I know people think that they're a little gimmicky, or but there's tons of bands that do that. Like look at Slipknot and everything, um, but I guess they're a lot heavier. I, like when I first looked at what the band looked like, I was expecting something super heavy, but now that I like am looking at them now and listening to their music, I'm like imagining just like uh, just 80s, 90s Halloween. Like, I don't mean Halloween the movie. I mean, just like, like old school decorations. Like how I mean, even look at like a uh, Karate Kid when, Cobra Kai dressed as like skeletons, just kind of that old school look. And I even like compared him to Skeletor earlier. Like that's just what, what it's kind of reminded me of so far, um, where it's not as like dark and demonic and in your face that I expected. But now it's more or less like giving me flashbacks like when I was a kid of like horror related and Halloween related toys and cartoons and things like that, which I love. This, this is awesome. I 
So we have some guitar leads going on a little bit. Kind of like the square hammer video, it looks like something's happening to the crowd when they play. Really good guitar work. Hopefully you don't hear too much of my uh, neighbor playing the grass right now. Nice. Uh-oh, yeah, this, this crowd's this crowd's getting possessed. It's like an 80s horror movie, the music. Oh, she's getting powers now. Alright, this is like, uh, yeah, this is like the ending of Carrie's spoiler for this. Yeah. But I think Carrie came out like, came out like, that game. That's so okay to see it by now. It's me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, we'll pause that. Oops. All right. Uh, that, there's a little bit of ad there. Yeah, that was awesome. I, I three songs in. Uh, consider me a fan. Thanks for watching. Like I said, I want to kind of do this sudden to keep this organic. I gotta check out more Ghost. Um, if you're a fan, leave it in the comments if there's any songs you think I should check out. Um, I'll, I may have gotten to them by the time that this gets uploaded and, you know, so on and so forth. But, uh, yeah, write down in the comment box anyway. If you like them and if you don't like them, tell me why. I'm actually curious because, you know, this band seems to have some controversy behind them and so on and so forth. Uh, I didn't do too much research, but I did see them pop up as supposedly they're a hated band by many. But, obviously liked by many, too. Good job, uh, Ghost, in my opinion. At least the first three songs I've heard, I liked. Uh, yeah, so guys, thank you for watching, and um, leave me some comments. Thank you.